Although I must say there aren't many better places to be on a beautiful night for football than St. James's Park. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable cause. It's Newcastle United against North East United. Well, Derek, we're looking forward to this game. You can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. So the starting 11 for Newcastle United. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. Here's the Newcastle United lineup. Number 22, Nick Pearl. Number 5, Fabian Scar. Number 33, Dan Burn. Number 36, Sean Monson. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, it's the same formation, but they use it to press the ball high up the field. And rarely do the wide players drop deep to defend. And watch out for the midfield three who continually rotate their positions. And number seven, John Thank you for attending St. James's Park. Enjoy the game. And the contest begins. Oh, managing to beat him. Well, let's see about the cross. And the referee blows for a foul. Well, later in the game, he might have seen yellow, but not at this early point. Yeah, but I'm with the referee. It's a foul, but no card. And deep into the penalty area. Joel Linton. Can he finish? Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, we know he's a good all-round player, but his strength is when balls are rolled into him. He can hold up the play, he can roll defenders, he can get away from them, and that's key to the way his team want to play. When they get the ball into him, that's when they're at their strongest. Oh, the keeper needed to do an awful lot better. Isaac. And the referee has given them a corner. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And no way through. This looks promising. Filippotto. Surely! Oh, that was begging to be put home. But the goalkeeper has it. Joe Willock. And he was in the right place to intercept. Who can he pick out? Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Room to Rome on the wing for Newcastle. Still possibilities. Well, whatever way you slice it, that was a terrible miss. Well, he'll know what a bad miss that was. I'm not sure how he got that off target.
Keeper not concentrating. Takes on the shot. And saved by the keeper. Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. <laughs> Playing it short. And another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, they're not standing off their opponents in the slightest. Trippier. Difficult to stop him. Nicely blocked, but he's got to get rid of it. Long staff. Isaac, are they going to forge ahead? Well, there is the opening goal. The pressure finally telling, and they get their due reward. Well, let's have another look, because this is a goal they have thoroughly deserved. They've played really well so far. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. And continues his run. Well, we're at the halfway mark here at St. James's Park. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, after a slow start where it was tightly marked, he got better and better as the first half went on, and he got his reward with that goal. I'm looking forward to his second half display. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, Interesting to see how the second half pans out. Joe Willock. A deft clearance. Joel Linton. Isaac. He's in with a chance. And a goal it is! They lead by two now. Fully deserved. Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. So the ball rolling again at 2 0. Well, the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick.
No nonsense clearance. Well, as you can see, Newcastle have had most of the ball and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Could be! Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. And a substitution in the offing. Now sending it in, and he clears the danger. Trippier, Isaac. Oh, wonderful save! Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. He's driven in the corner. Able to get a body in the way. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Almiron. Intercepting it intelligently. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Defenders need to cover. Well, it petered out. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Jakobsen. This looks interesting. Chance to play it in. Well, quite simply, the cross was too close to the keeper. Trippier. Well, the second half drawing to a close. Newcastle fans will be excited about this. Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play and they've... It's got to be! Well, he's missed the chance and the keeper didn't have to do very much. And that's an important intervention. Might be a chance here. Surely... Well, just centimetres over the bar with that powerful shot. So a personnel change then. A oh, super piece of play. He has time to play it over. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. He might be able to carve something out. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Short corner it is. And that will be all for this game. Defeat for the visitors, that's the big story. Well, Derek, they were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the board in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.